Venezuela deeply regrets that Colombian President Juan Manuel Santos have been taking some actions to derail bilateral ties with Venezuela when he decided to meet in Bogotá with Miranda State Governor Enrique Capriles. Venezuela national authorities also denounced that the neighbor country is preparing a conspiracy. Venezuela Minister of Foreign Affairs denounced that Bogotá is preparing a conspiracy against Venezuela and considered this move as a very bad sign. Colombia answered it back saying they will deal this affair in a direct form and far apart from what they consider as a microphone diplomacy. The conference promoted by Union of South American Nations on Natural Resources for Region Integral Development will end today in Venezuelan capital city. In this conference, representatives consider different economic, social and environmental issues. The fifth working table will be established before conference closing ceremony in order to identify instruments to be used in a South American strategy related to UNASUR's integral development. El Salvador's justice system denied a therapeutic abortion to be practiced to a 22 years old girl. She suffers from lupus and her baby doesn't have a complete brain. The Constitutional Hall of Court rejected the claim submitted to help Beatriz. The young girl from El Salvador suffers from lupus and she requested a constitutional protection on April 11th to interrupt her pregnancy due to her disease. In addition, her baby suffers from an encephaly. It means that it doesn't have a complete brain. This case has encouraged debates on abortion in El Salvador, which is one of five Latin American countries who don't allow abortion. Russian Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sergei Lavrov, affirmed that Syrian opposition is trying to boycott the International Peace Conference promoted by Russia and the United States. Lavrov stated this during a joint press conference with Cuban Minister of Foreign Affairs, Bruno Rodriguez Parrilla. Both the Cuban and Russian ministers discussed relations between Moscow and Havana and the Russian support of Moscow to the community of Latin American and Caribbean states, CELAC. <laughs>